Happy 4th of July! This is Aiden's first 4th of July celebration. Uh, so there's did Ryan. Did the started? Yeah, Ryan did it. Oh. Party started. And he made all the hot dogs. <laughs> I know, it was going to take so long, so I cooked, or your mo mom told me to cook them. Yeah, yeah, well, we, we See? went to 7-Eleven yeah, yeah. because I thought that's the only thing that's open. Yeah, we went to two stores. Then, of course, we realized they didn't have anything, so then mm -hmm. we realized that the farm was open. And then Ryan knows that I like my hot dogs dark, so he did it very dark. So I can't complain about them not being dark enough. How's your wrist now? <laughs> a little bit better, it helps. Oh. Arzu's wrist is sore because she's a flutist. Is that how you say it? Flutist or flautist? Flautist. flautist. Yeah. And she overdoes the muscles. <laughs> I haven't practiced in two months, though. Oh, you haven't practiced in two months? <laughs> no, not since, like, beginning of June. So you probably have in withdrawal. Maybe, I don't know. It's, it just flared up. Ouch. This is Aiden's first 4th of July. <laughs> Four and a half months old. Mm. And he had a barbecue. So it's his first barbecue. <laughs> okay, my grandson is now four years old, and I'm finally going to post these photos in video on YouTube. Okay, that's enough kissing. But it was after much self wondering and reflection because although this is one of the funniest moments I ever experienced with my grandson and he laughed so hard and it was so adorable I do feel very guilty for number one allowing an animal to be so close to my grandson yikes but also thinking about the germs and the dogs but the dogs did stay in the house most of the time except for when they were taken out to for walks to go to the bathroom and you know they were very clean dogs but I know that some people probably would freak out thinking that a dog would lick a baby's mouth but um, I've also recently discovered and saw a mother not only let her toddler pick up food he dropped on a very busy public floor at a Goodwill, which was really disgusting to me. I told the kid to drop it because it was icky nasty, but the mom turned around and demanded the kid pick it up and finish eating it. <laughs> grossed me out. So I could see how some people would be grossed out by this, and I might be getting a lot of slack from it, and hopefully my son and Aiden's mom isn't angry that I let the dogs kiss him, <laughs> but it was, it was really the most endearing, cute, I wish I videoed it actually, the laughing was so hard and so cute, and if you search on YouTube, you could see other people who have posted it, and you could hear the laughter, it is just so loud, so cute, they're enjoying it so much, it's so funny, I wish I had the video of it, but I think at the time, even, I was feeling guilty that I was even taking pictures. So it's adorable. I'm sharing it now. My grandson's now four. He never had to be rushed to the hospital that I know of. Um, he was fine at the time and he's now a very healthy four-year-old and I hope everything, everybody enjoys this because I do. I wish okay, I did more of that video. Good. Anyway, enjoy. Enjoy your children. And always make sure that your children are exposed to as many good germs as possible because you want to strengthen their immunity. And I learned that by watching the lady who actually insisted that her child pick that up off the dirty floor in Goodwill, which I think that was extreme, but at least it made me feel much better about this dog licking video. <laughs>